Hey yo, welcome back everyone to the Bard playthrough. What? Another visit back to the Bard? Well, yes. I don't know why I said well, yes. Uh, the Bard actually got some new items added in. And sorry if the resolution is weird. I recently bought... Oh god, I'm good now. I recently bought a uh, widescreen monitor. A very widescreen monitor. Don't kill me. And... I don't know. I gotta tweak a bunch of settings. Like, for when I render the videos and edit them, I gotta tweak the settings so, like, when it renders it... It makes it everything everything look normal. I don't know how to do that though, so we're gonna hope for the best. Can these guys stop spawning? No, I'm trying to like do stuff. Okay, so new items. Let's should we do the weapons first? Nah, let's not do the weapons first. Let's do this first. There's an item called the Balladeer's tuba. And I know we're, I know we're in the Balladeer armor, but the Ballad. Please leave me alone. I can't shoot. Stop. Just give me a second. Balladeer's tuba. There it is. Boom. It's a uh, flight thing. Can we get this out of here? How do I turn the Oh my god, I forgot that my settings got changed. Alright, you know, just make it. Boom. Allows flight and slow fall. Now this is a really, really good wing set. I don't know if better than uh Where am I looking? I don't know if better than the uh Sheriff Tracers, probably not. But it, they're still pretty damn good for wings obviously not seraph tracer good but if you're just using thorium which i expect many of you to do you know if you're easing yourself into mods use thorium it's a nice nice starting mod because it's very terraria like vanilla terraria like but let's see if we can get warding it doesn't matter it doesn't actually matter at all boom now i'm super slow though because i don't have boots it's fine uh let's kill this guy real quick but these things go 146 blocks i believe which is pretty goddamn high, and they got the little cool effect behind them. So this was added, and a uh, healer class one was also added. So it's pretty dope. We're not gonna wear it. Though. I mean, we can wear it as like, as like a style. Like, look, it looks really cool with the armor set, the full armor set. But this is my boy Kaz here. This is my boy Kaz Minicus. All right, he rocks the. He doesn't rock the helmet. Dude, these enemies spawn way too often. All right, so moving on from that. We have a boss drop and we have a craftable. Let's do the craftable first. Easier to make. It's a harmonica. You can make it very early in the game. Uh, you find like a wooden chest at the beginning of the game. Boom. Harmonica created. What if the wooden chest has iron? That's a nice little tune there. I don't know if you guys can hear it because this Garden Eden music is loud as shit. All right. So let's see here. Where is my mutant at? Do we have one? Did we ever get one? Yeah, okay, there's one. So we're gonna talk to the mutant, and we're gonna use the harmonica uh, for the boss that we're gonna kill here, the jellyfish. And be like, why are you gonna kill the jellyfish? The jellyfish has a new drop. That's why we're killing jell the jellyfish. I stuttered on my words. Okay, then just get rid of that guy. So I don't know when we'll be making a like a like continual episode revisit to this character. Because, like, I just don't think this character gets enough content in big chunks. And primarily that reason is because Diamond Man Sam is actually working a lot on the healer right now. And to finish all the healer stuff, sorry if there's any, like, stutter or anything. I haven't played this world in a while. It's probably, like, reloading everything in. Like, look, it's, like, slowly stuttering. Oh, my God, there's only like trees here that aren't here. Uh, I don't know what mod that is. But uh, he's working really hard on the... Uh, the healer aspect of the mod and making the healer have two paths a damage path and a regular path just like a support path it's pretty well they're both support paths but i think one of them you can produce damage when you can't i don't know it's very interesting it's very unique what he's doing i like it a lot hopefully we see more of it. oh hopefully we see some of this soon all right now the question is how long would this take to kill this boss with this very long shoot one of these how fast would this make the fight very fast okay use the weakest weapon here we go use the weapons we never really used in the playthrough are these new weapons this is a new weapon isn't it i don't know actually all right we're gonna fight 10 of them using all these weapons i don't think i use this like at all imagine having Ooh, something just hit me we might have to try this out before the end of this episode Oh, what is this overhauled boss? What is this? I don't remember this. <laughs> I don't remember that from the boss. Hold up. It 
music is still the same though, so this boss is definitely gonna get an overhaul soon. Oh look, the slimes are different. Spitting slimes? Were they always like that? Wait, what do the blue ones look like? The tiny blue ones. Hold on, I kinda wanna see. Oh, they're just really tiny and blue. They're just regular, pretty much. Okay, I like the overhaul of the boss, but we're gonna need that music to overhaul. What is that? Is that this thing buffing me? I don't know. There's like a little Medusa head every time I use it. Alright, how often do I use this weapon, too? Like, I don't know. Oh, okay, I remember this weapon. This weapon's pretty OP if you find the right range. Oh my god. He got murked. Wait, wait, come here. Can we wait for the bard class to start getting, like, unique sounds for, like, every single, like, string or whatever you do on an instrument, depending on what instrument it is? This, the, this, uh, Sage's Lament, we'll call it. What are they actually called? I was gonna say ukulele, but that didn't make sense. Uh, harmonica. No, that's not what these are called. I don't remember the word for it. Slinky. No. <laughs> the hell's the word for it? Accordion. There you go. Uh, this sounds like it kind of has unique sounds already. But I don't know. But when you do something like this, like it just sounds like you're playing a guitar, not a violin. This kind of has its unique noises, but it can use a little bit more here and there lower note i don't know i'm not a music person did i become a music person oh wait i forgot these are also weapons i don't know why uh did i become a music person after playing this doing this playthrough nope was i supposed to i don't know maybe i'm destined to learn music after this the bard playthrough has taught me my ways the errors of my ways it's revealed a whole new life path all right so there you go there's all that let's head home Store everything that isn't from that boss fight. So, might as well suck up everything. You never know when we'll need things on the floor. All right, we'll put the harmonica away. Boom, 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 boom. It's gotta be in here. Give me at least once. Don't give me these green dildos. What are we looking for, you may be asking? Oh, it's right there. Okay, we're good, we're good. So luckily we got it there. Out of 10 bosses, thank God. Conch shell. Oh my god, it does 53 damage. That's pretty good for how late in the game I am. Whoa, what the hell? Uh, plays a rising song of the sea. So it's like that, but it rises. Do I control this? Like, control the waves of it? No, not really. Um, what does it do? Deals increased damage to targets above you. Damage your powers player with bonus 2. Let me just spawn in like a zombie or something. You know that sorcerers work. Well, it's kind of hard to get things above you. I mean, you can do that. That's not bad at all. All right, there's that. Uh, now, the thing I wanted to test, and I don't know if, how it's going to work. There's a certain enchantment from the Fargo's mod. I think it's Fargo's mod. There's a certain enchantment that gives you three projectiles on magic items or whatever. I don't know exactly what items. But let me see if I can find it here. It's gotta be around here. All right, we have uh, we have the soul here. I'm gonna test it out real quick. It seems worse. Oh, time out. Oh, hold up here. It might have worked. Oh my god. Okay, that didn't really seem different. That. <laughs> it's definitely shooting three out, which I expected would happen. Oh my god. This is pretty insane. That's pretty insane. I kind of want to try it out now. This one doesn't seem like it's corresponding very well. It looks like it's having a little bit of trouble. Alright, let's uh... Have we ever beat Ragnarok? <laughs> I don't think we ever beat Ragnarok in this playthrough. It's fine, don't worry about it. Now, I just spawned in the Soul Terraria because I couldn't find... I couldn't find the description of what I was looking for. So I was like, why not just get all of them in at once and see if that works. Alright. Oh, God. Fraps is doing that thing where it dies. Alright, let me see. I don't know if I'll be able to see. Stop. Stop. I just want a one-hit Betsy, please. Just let me one-hit her. Quickly, before Fraps dies. 